Hey everyone, uh, this is going to be uh, a quick uh, look through of Boo's results from her Embark DNA veterinary test. Uh, forgive the noise in the background, but um, our little one is watching her iPad. Alright, so let's see what we have here. Health results. All right, not at risk. Read on, tell them more about. Oh, that's interesting. Ah, hypercarcerea. What is that? Let's see what that's all about. Okay. I don't know yet. Okay, so we don't have any plans to breed blue. So that's good. Right, let's go back to summary. Oh, okay. Genetic summary. She's Staffy, Lab, German Shepherd, Husky, Chow Chow, Rottweiler. Oh, that's surprising. Rottweiler. Huh, that's where she gets her eyes. Those big blue eyes of hers. Oh, look at that. She's got some woofiness. What does that mean? I'm not sure. Oh, wow. Wolf gene markers. Oh, that's pretty cool. This part right here. Although that is very much up for debate right now. But that's neither here nor there with the with this what we're doing here. Sixty three pounds. That's almost right on. I think she's uh sixty five right now. I might have to do this. Okay. Ancestry health. Let's check out her health. Not at risk. We already saw that. We already saw that. Okay. MDR1. This is really important. How do you say that word? Coagulopathy. Coagulopathy. Yay. That's good. So this is German Shepherd dog. Wow. I've never even heard of half of this stuff. It's crazy that it's all genetic conditions that they can test for. Wow, if we went through all of these, this would take a really long time. <laughs> Dog can suffer from narcolepsy. Retrievers. Huh. Let's see, just for seeing seeing what's going on with this. Let's see what you would. I wonder if her, uh, what's it called, um, entropian, she has entropian in her eyes, which is like her awesome. eyebrows get into her eye and cause, um, irritation. I guess that's not a genetic condition. 
That's a lot of stuff though they test for. Oh moly, there's more liver skin. Pretty nifty. Uh, let's see, let's look at the breed ancestor. Family tree. That's pretty cool. Compared to the Wisdom panel, this is much, much more in depth. I mean, Wisdom panel has something similar to this. We had Sully tested with Wisdom panel back when we got them. And I think it only goes to great grandparents. And this is all that you get with that test. As you can see, this one is much, much more in depth. I don't know what this is. Oh, that's pretty nice. neat. What does this mean? This time we'll use a roller to roll the play doh out. Now we'll use a scooper to shape it like an ice cream scoop. Huh, that's cool. Pretty cool. <laughs> that is pretty neat. Let's see what Brie families have to say. I'm not 100% sure what these numbers make up for. I wonder if they add up to 100. Okay. So yeah, it does add up to a hundred. That's pretty cool. And then we get this thing that we can send to the vet. Which is pretty cool as well. Oh, okay. Pretty cool. I guess I'll have to do this later. This is something I wanted to check though. There's something about her genetic age here. Let's see what that's about. Under health, maybe? Hello, Hi, Mom. What do you have there? What is that? It's a helicopter dino. Ooh, can I take a look? Yeah. Play school heroes, Jurassic World, Dino Truck Helicopter. And you can even do this. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, even here. Uh, oh, no, wasn't here. Is it in the breeding section? I don't remember where I saw it. I 
Am I going crazy? I know I saw that. Ah, there it is. Let's see what this is all about. The boys are around three years old right now, I believe. I'll write this later. Yes, my love. Yeah. I concur with your assessment. Ago would have been 2013. So June 2013. About the 9th of June. Estimated. That is correct. Done for now. Let's see what we get for a genetic age. Thirty-three human years. Oh moly! So old. She's mi middle aged, or right? she's the same age as me. Oh yeah, I've heard this a lot. I think we've actually wrote about that a couple times. Pretty nice though. It's pretty cool to know her genetic age. I'm a big fan of this test compared to Wisdom Panel. There's so much more here and so much more useful information as well. Alright, but I think that's pretty much it. Um, I don't think there's anything else that we can show here. Yep, that's about it. Alright, thanks for stopping by and thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed and uh, if you want to go ahead and um, get one of these Embark tests, um, I'll be sure to uh, include a link in, in uh, the description of this video. Alright, thanks.